Yeah. Staff of the Great Beyond or Gazing Finger? Both are garbage. I went with the giant bunker though because of course I did. Even though it requires intelligence, which I have none of. I like the giant axe. I'm going to keep this giant axe. I really enjoy it. Really want to max it out. Wish I had kept one for myself. So I feel like I never really explored the entirety of this land. I am all the way up here uh, properly because I was kind of so desperate to uh, find the map. So I'm going to do that now with a little bit more intention. Clearly, you have already seen me do that. So I'm just going to show you the, the new discoveries and then we'll keep on exploring this magical land. You know, when I was going through these places, I really didn't... It didn't register how pretty it is. Luna, just sit down and be quiet, Luna. She's bunking against the microphone, being a, being a naughty cat. Luna, just lay down and be quiet, Luna. Don't make me throw you into a blender, Luna. She's okay. She won't be thrown into the blender unless she tests me too much. Anyway, I don't know... I, I have no memory of being here. <laughs> it's like, I was so focused, just tunnel visioned on maybe reaching that map. I have no memory of traversing this area right here, but I am sure that uh, we're, we're going to remember. This is heading toward a place I've already been, I understand, but I am sure that I will find somewhere new to be. That is the side of grace that I already enabled where where is that that just goes places it goes to a different place I, I i do vaguely remember going up those those stairs don't worry i'll get to the place where i haven't been yet don't worry about me it's gonna happen you know this doesn't look familiar luna you have to stop you have to stop you're bonking against the microphone this is not right i do not allow this they didn't put you on my lap so you could be an inconvenience I was here doing some video gaming and you go and start mounting at me for no reason from your silly cardboard box and you just uh, engage against this piece of trash and you want attention and now you are demanding even more attention this cannot be no stop doing that stop bucking the microphone down <laughs> silly feline fool anyway there's two enemies over there so what we do in this in this scenario we don't give a crap about the double enemy. We attract them from afar. Get sniped. A bitch. Get absolutely wrecked by my incredible ah! <laughs> incredible ability to do range battle. Oh, oh, you're upset? You want a piece of this? Oh, yeah. Oh. Ah, ah, ah. Stop it. Stop it. Get help. All right. All done. You have no idea who you're messing with. I have slaughtered so many of your ilk. Let me do some sniping. We get time for one long one, a short one, and a lightning. Look, I have fought a bunch of these. I don't need to prove myself. And then one of these! Oh yeah, man, that's badass. Feels great to have the tools to murder these people instead of constantly scrambling to not be destroyed by the likes of them. They are one of the more challenging enemies in the entirety of the game, but it's not a boss. Uh, all right, we went out of there, came out, did battle at the range. Or a nice little uh, gazebo over here, very beautifully built. We carry on. We're definitely in unknown territory. I have not explored through this entire area might we find yet another of these filthy horn scent no <laughs> no <laughs> why you doing this do you recognize them do you see them they are the more filthy red insect rot can i just avoid it let me just put a marker over there <laughs> i'll be back uh, I can't handle it anymore. I can't handle it right now. 
I'm going to just let it be. Why am I going back? Look, it's shiny. I need to have it. <sighs> going back for the thin beast bones. A couple stairs over here. What's your problem? What is the damage happening to you? What was that? I don't know. I don't know what that was about. But that already was back there. No, no more rot. I despise it. We need to find a cairn. What are you? Ah, oh, infected uh, folks. Man, they're all the uglies are here, huh? I have no interest in fighting you. I've already slaughtered 70 of your kind. No more of you fat cells. You piece of trash. No, Luna, what are you doing? Okay, she jumped off. Uh, she got tired of not being paid attention to. Here I was, putting it on my lap. She enjoys that a great deal. She will literally sleep for, there for... What the... What are you doing? I literally slept there for an hour and a half. Outrageous. Most of time she was... Ah! <laughs> of course these scumbags are back. They are not permanently deleted from my existence. Is that a blob? No, it's a dog. Probably nothing to be found here, right? You always look at the freaking uh, waterfalls, though. All right, <laughs> let's go. Now I have a vendetta though, against those disgusting disciples of rot. We're going to go find them, and I'm going to actually engage them with a little bit of respect instead of just, <laughs> just going to run through here real quick and uh, treat you as trivial encounters. No, we're going to visit death and pain upon this garbage. Get lightning speared, the disgusting dog. Now that's more like it. Absolutely obliterated the power of my magic. Oh, come on, you didn't get, that, you didn't get killed by that? It's so OP. It's just literally too OP. You, I will fight with my bare hands. This cannot stand. Your horrible humiliation that you inflicted upon me. At first, though, I'll grab my million runes. Thank you very much. You can uh, go around here and provoke more dogs. Why would I do that? I don't know. Oh, this uh, this is a drop. All right, all right. Let's do battle. Let's do battle. Is he coming? No, that, I'm targeting the dog now, uh, which is what I want. Eat it, fatso. Holy crap. Something that you're probably very fond of doing. Just eating it. Man, you're enormous. That's what she said. Ah. I don't want to die. I don't want to die horrendously. Ooh. Come on, do it. Yeah. Oh, beautiful hit. Absolutely gorgeous. Yo, what's up, Sabola? Oh, <laughs> right, <you did> <laughs> nightmare enemy, and you dropped nothing. He really looked kind of special. I thought for sure he would be, you know, a special case of enemy instead of being a major pain in my ass for nothing. <laughs> I accept it. It's just how it be. What you want me to do about it? Okay, there's no way down. I don't think that doesn't just kill me or put me somewhere. That I've already been. Where are we right now? Yeah, yeah, that's just uh, an abyss. So we rolled back. So there was like zero reason to come this way. <laughs> just to get molested by dogs and a fat So What a what a terrible reminder. Oh, of my college days. I got lost in that bad neighborhood. I have no interest. I have no interest. Chop your aggression right up your asshole. Don't care. I'm just going to run all around you. wonder if that's death I'm going down that way. Stop yelling. That is Ruth. That is uncouth. I guess we're going down. A few dogs. We need to find the cairn. How very silly. What do you have to say, though? I want a hint. Give me a hint. Yeah, no kidding. Ill omen creature, therefore try a necessary item. Are you the ill omen creature? Are you the thing that I need to destroy? Likely a dog. 
<laughs> oh, you have dropped into my trap where the lightning will do short work of you. Get absolutely murdered. What is going on back here? He's just a dog. All right. Well, let's find that silly, silly kern. Wonder if it's only to get back to where I was at or it gives me access to a different spot. Uh, probably way back down here. They're not often really far. They're usually really, really close. To the point that, it, like, I keep complaining, it's just silly. But there was at least one that re required a little bit of trickery. Where am I? Where am I? Have I been here? No. Have I? She. I think I was already here. The place that I said earlier, oh, this is so pretty. So all this time, are you saying that I just went down here like an idiot and that thing is a shortcut? And the cairn is somewhere on the top? Yes, yes, the answer to all those is yes. Fine, fine, I'll go into this damn place. Although I really would like to find a stupid ass garbage cairn. Let me, let me go find that, because it does create a much easier shortcut to get up here. So I'm going to find it, damn it. All right, back in this little place, he had a bunch of fatsos and a bunch of dogs. They're probably guarding. Go away. I hate you. Get off the horse. Whoa. Fine, if you want the trouble of my company, you shall have it. I'm so pissed right now. <laughs> so annoyed. You scum lords. You will get nothing but violence out of me. You sealed your damn fate. Lightning. Ha! Pathetic. What? Kosa! Can I withstand the incredible might of battle? Ooh, lightning. Oh, I'm out of juice. Ooh. I'm like, that thing hit us as, as beautifully as it usually does. Correct. Oh, you poor bastard. Trying to slow me down in any way. Uh, at the very least, I uh, can just explore what the hell is back here without just running through it like a maniac. It's okay. It should exist. It just makes a lot of sense for it to be somewhere up here. There's another fatso up here that just molested me earlier. This piece of scum. Get wrecked. Hmm. Hmm. You? No. <laughs> You're just a ball of fluff. Alright, I'll find it. I'll find it. Don't worry about it. It's somewhere around here. I know it. Narrator. He did not find it. But, I did get all the way up here from jumping over there. Here's where these scum lords are at. Ha! Give me whatever you're carrying is mine now. Oh, baby. A revered spirit ash. Just what I covet. Mmm, okay. I'm hoping. Oh, it's absolutely nothing. <laughs> it's just... Just a little bit of revered ash, fine. I give up. I give up completely. If I ever get killed, I guess I'll just go back. That's just death down there, huh? Let's go to the damn insects of rot and be extremely miserable. I didn't mean to dismount there. It's right around the corner. I don't even need to uh, pause the recording. It's right there. We can go up this ladder, these stairs. And uh, do I, what do I want? Do I want to engage with the place, or do I want to just run past them? Let's engage with the damn place. I absolutely despise insect men. They're so awful. So I will engage with the place, but cowardly. Pow! Yeah, of course you do that. Of course you would do that because you're a filth, craven filth like myself. 
Well, that was anticlimactic. Is that freaking Scarlet Rot, man? Is that Holy crap! That is an insane power of damage. Damn. Damn. All right, give me, give me some uh, freaking blessings over here. That's insanity. Took away half my freaking health pool. It's going to be rot. You know it's going to be rot. I know it's going to be rot. Everybody knows it's rot. <sighs> Hello, sir. Or creature of some description. Die! I don't think I even uh, have flame... Oh, yeah, I do. It's all good. It's all good. Flame cleanse me is here to save my life. How do people play this video game without flame cleansing? I don't know, man. It will be so much more miserable without it. Can you go into the damn swamps? Alright, that's an elevator. Let's go back here. Cleanse me again. I need it. Are you a lazy bones? No, you're not just laying there. We look around corners. We don't trust a damn thing. Here's me being stealthy. Look at me. I want the loot, and I want to suffer for it. It's terribly dark here. All right. I love to... I mean, why not? Why not just eat the inventory I just grabbed? I mean, the, the meat that I just grabbed? There you go. Oh, delicious. All right. What in the hell is that monstrosity? Oh, no, it's just an insect man in front of a plant. I was terribly traumatized for a second there. All right, we engage. Mistake were made. Die. Okay, nobody else got immediately alerted. They're coming, but in their slow, menacing crawl. Oh, I wonder if the bear will do good against them. In the face. Maybe the bear will be enormously helpful. I'm willing to turn to try it out. <laughs> you poor pathetic poise buffoons. Oh no! Oh no! Immediately destroyed! That is so insanely overpowered. Holy crap. Oh man, I didn't realize that. So what? <laughs> How many have I picked up? That's just silly. All right, turns out I was maybe pretty underleveled in the Skibbity Tree Fragment Department. Let's see how I fare now. I utterly murdered the ones coming up, the ones leading up to this spot, but none of them landed their attack. Wonder if it's worth doing the bear or just stop being a fool. I really want to get the this guy's goat. Maybe we can sneak behind him, steal his flowers. Oh, get destroyed. Charge up the attack. Oh. So good. Am I now full of rot in my anus? Pretty full of rot. Pretty gross. Alright. I don't know if it's worth even coming this way, but... Damn it, I'm gonna make it work. Okay, they are menacingly advancing upon my position. Uh, it was the right choice to use magics. But uh, let's give them a little bit of more respect. The problem with the bear is that it takes forever for the bear to come out. Can you attack me from there? No, you cannot. You cannot. <laughs> Get ambushed. A roar! <laughs> I love it. I love the bear. The bear is great. Uh, eh, it's just too slow. Too slow. This regular attack will do it. Right, I have murdered your filthy congregation. You silly worshipper of dirt. Wow, 
eight? Level two? Fly mold. <laughs> I love it. It's so helpful. Thank you, Miyazaki. Destroy. Oh, you're fat. No, you're not. You're just more devout than your, fr than your friends. But you're still a pushover. Uh, that was great. Very happy to have done that just to cleanse the world of their filth. Very glad they are no longer here. Where the hell am I? <laughs> hey, uh, Mr. Meditation Man. Have you uh, achieved Nirvana? Of course you have a potentate book. Uh, hefty rot pot. Wow. <laughs> All these pots I'll never use. And that's his death. All right. Well, that was massively not worth it, but I'm glad I did it anyway. Now we go up the elevator. That we saw earlier. Get me in there. What shall we find? I am sure it will be nothing but happiness. More rot. Bleh. Likely lever. Lever tarnished. <laughs> How helpful. I love it. Okay. How about we want to you eat one of my attacks? You know, you 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 may not escape. Rah! Protect me, flame. Wait, this is not this is not cleanse me. This is protect me. Are you using the wrong one all along? No, I do have cleanse me. All right. <laughs> Get me protected. Some kind of nonsense over here. Let's clear out the rot area. Make sure that we have a marker to return. When these guys l are actually actively looking at you, it's always a bad idea to approach. You wanna be a little bit more stealthy about it. Scarlet Bud. It's a Scarlet Friend. Oh, you're just looking at uh, people approaching, huh? Nope! <laughs> we reject this proposition. Get the hell away from me. Lightning! No, don't do it again! Oh, no, no. I, mean, I could just charge him. I can dodge. I'm capable. But I don't trust him being alone. Oh, you need to try harder, you bitch! Now your friend is all alone. <laughs> Good boost. Charge up. Nope, they don't mean to do that, but it's what I committed to, I guess. Ah, yes, much better. What a wonderful interaction, what you have. What? Oh, this is actually an incantation, isn't it? Incantations! Secrete! Sticky threads and twist them into two frontward flying spears. We're going to turn their tools against them. Skill of the pests known as the kindred of rot. Now wield it as an incantation. Secrete numerous sticky threads. Then twist them into two spears. Launch a front wars charge to enhance, enhance potency. The pests are abandoned servants. And it is for this reason they found a mother in the saint of the bud. Abandoned servants. I guess by millennia in this place? Or is it... Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know enough lore to hazard even a guess. Probably the pests came after Millennia did the whole rot thing, right? I don't know. I don't know anything about chronology of the entire thing. I don't think they were attached to Millennia in the first place. They were, are just kind of parasites. I just uh, latched on the entire rot thing. What is even the point of coming this way? This is foolish. So literally nothing here. What is that? Just a pile of crap, okay. <laughs> that literal crap that I just stomped on. Alright. This is good. I really thought there would be something up the end of these stairs. I see the the sight of grace. Ooh, and I'm seeing a boss. I'm 
seen a boss. I am at the top of the ruins of Rau. This may be the boss. Because I got nowhere else to go. Uh, and then from here, you know, you give yourself access to that other spot. That church that is full of vines. So I'm going to hazard a guess that this is the area's final... Ooh, you even get a story? Summon? Who the hell are you? <laughs> You're like a... I mean, I'll summon you. Dryleaf Dane. How about you come with me now? Let's go fight together the rest of the level. Oh, when you summon somebody, you can no longer ride. I need to go back down because there was the one path I didn't follow. So I'm gonna do that. Oh, he returned to the one. <laughs> He's like, I'm not gonna go fight some books with you. I have a, a beef with this dude behind the wall. We can't be foolishly traversing this land and being fight buddies. What you got? Did I just go in a massive circle? Or is this a completely different area? No, that, I have not grabbed that piece of loot, so... We can uh, rest assured. I mean, we respect the horn scent. They are super beefy. That's why I even open with range attacks instead of just jumping to the fray. I've killed like 20 of them. Oh, but you look different though. You have a, like a bird face. You're new and exciting. What? Look at all. Woo! Woo! Get wrecked, son. <laughs> I feel no guilt whatsoever. Divine bird face. And then a somber smithing stone. What, are, what the hell are divine bird feathers? It's another incantation. Spread arms like wings and release that flurry of feathers. A technique of the divine bird warriors, the very first of all horn, the very first of the horn warriors wielding is an incantation. Spread the arm, blah, blah, blah. Hold to continue releasing feathers. The divine bird warriors, and indeed this technique, are said to bear resemblance to the golden crucible. All right, awesome, amazing, great. So that's a crucible incantation, so you would want the helmet for that. If you want to maximize your potential. Let's see. Doesn't seem to be anything over in this place. I'm still looking for that cairn. I have not <laughs> lost hope that it inhabits one of these damn locations. It is very possible. I have completely overlooked it already. I bypassed it entirely. Make sure. Is this a place to go down or is it just not just another cascade full of misery? Cascade of sorrow. At the bottom of which only awaits despair. No reason to go there. There is a path here, though. This is probably a shortcut to somewhere. I will be surprised if it leads in a, to a completely different location. Look at me. Look at me unlocking a freaking shortcut. I vaguely remember coming across this, actually. This leads to the big stairs, doesn't it? I don't want to go through this nonsense. Hey, is this piece of scum? Yeah, okay, I get it. I know what's going on. All right, well, uh, one of these days, I will unlock that cairn, and it will be glorious. It will be so great. <laughs> but I don't think today is that day. So let's go back to battle a boss, I suppose. I was on my way back, and I was like, oh, I never went up there. Let me uh, check it real quick. <laughs> Oh, Miyazaki, how you love your, your pranks. Whee! Wonderful. Where do you lead? You just put me back where I came back. It's just a shortcut to somewhere that I can easily reach with a side of grace. <laughs> how helpful! <laughs> just get out of here. We're gonna see who the hell is beyond the curtain. And I am um, ready to summon this fellow. Although he's a silent guy, he's just a helper, right? Uh, he, he's not going to say a damn thing. So I can pass. I can pass on this dude. Lover ahead. 
Likely bugs, secret passage. Be wary of scarily run and then try fire. For now, we're gonna stick with what we got and we'll adapt to our inevitable death. Speaking of which, might as well spend these 1.6 million runes. I never checked out a bunch of incantations that I picked up and never realized it. That's really cool. I wonder how far it goes. I'd like to try this out. I mean, the range is pretty ass. Let me uh, memorize a different one. Uh, I want to see the bird feathers. I know what the pest spears are going to look like, but I do want to see the feathers. Get out of here. Let's see. That looks like ass. <laughs> I don't really like it. Don't like it in the slightest. I like what I had. The bear is fun. The bear is good stuff. Uh, I will I will try out the tornado though. That looks pretty badass. Alright, alright. We're ready. I did change to a flame weapon. Am I fat rolling? I am indeed. Let's see. Probably get rid of this super heavy greaves. There you go. Something a little bit a little bit lighter. Let's check it out. Did I Yeah I did, I did. It's all good. It's all good. Let's do the nasty with whatever lies behind trapdoor number one. Of course, with full protection and elemental protection. Probably not gonna be great because of the fact that it's probably one of the rot enemies. What in the hell? Romina, Saint of the Bud. Disturbing? Disturb what is going on? What the? What a strange, weird creature! That's disturbing as hell! It's like a centipede that has a person in the middle getting failed. You absolute garbage creature. Uh, not terribly impressed. I may have been slightly hasty. What the? It's hardly rot. I am being rotten. I am being rotted terribly. Oh, you have a second. Oh, jeez! <laughs> second face! Damn. Ow! The thing is. Uh, I'm like, uh, where are you going? My Scarlet Rod disappeared. Ah, uh, don't stand on it. I see, I see how that works. Very cool, though. Woo! <laughs> I had no right to avoid that. No right whatsoever. Here, eat some of this fire. I'm caught in your legs. Helps out quite a bit when you carry me with you. <laughs> you carry me with you. Get absolutely wrecked by the fiery blade going straight into your guts. Very nice. I like that a lot. Some really cool moves. I may have used too many Skibbity Tree Fragments yet again because boy did that absolute bitch go down like a piece of garbage but zero guilt associated because she wanted me to rot from the inside out so i have no problem undoing her life let me see what the hell this soul yields first time i hear about this romina person saint of the bud hewn into the scatter tree the power of its namesake can be low. After the church was burned to the ground, Romina discovered a twisted divine element which she weaved into the baleful scarlet rot. Perhaps then the buds might find somewhere to gain purchase once more within the scorched remains of somebody we know. A love weapon of Romina, Saint of the Bud, a scarlet glaive with a dangling bud like blade. Attacks cause buildup of rot. Once in the crumbling, burning church, Romina held the bud in speechless silence. That bud would become her blade. Very cool. Incantation used by Romina, Saint of the Bud. This may be the one that I duplicate. What does the strength dex and arcane? Mwop, mwop, mwop. I will take. I will take the incantation. And not duplicate it in the slightest. We'll bind it to my person. And then we'll go back, see what the hell is at the top of that. I always jump on top to go touch it, but you just need to uh, go into the, the side of the mountain here. Thing is, I already have things that I want to try. 
Rotten Butterflies. Fine, well, let go of the frenzy burst much as it pains me. Just temporarily. So I can cast some butterflies, yeah. Beautiful, all right, let me go back. All right, brother, I got nowhere else to go. We are done with this map. This is it. And it, it really does circle. Go, you, it sends you on a merry chase of power and sorrow. And then gets you to a place where you have a perfect direct view of the uncursing of this land. Can I ride it? You cannot ride here. Let's just go up in a very momentous fashion to the altar. I decide to cut down this shadow tree and free us all from this horrible influence. Oh, you examine it. I want to burn it down. I want to destroy it. What's your problem? No, you're just lost in lamentation. Give me a beautiful cutscene. I deserve it. Burn the ceiling tree. Before I do this, let me talk one more time to Lita in case I am wrecking uh, a quest line before doing this. Eh, she says quite the quite exact same thing. I'm quite mm, I don't know. It just feels so momentous. It feels like, you know, you're entering the end game. So I need to make sure all the NPCs are as, as terminal as they can be. Well, here's the thing. I just teleported to the place. Oh, this is not it. But I realized, hey, uh, the NPCs are not there anymore. Let me go see if Ansbach left a piece of loot. Where is that? I do want to see. Yeah, Freya's not even here. I, and I forget exactly what she wanted, so I have no idea where she's at. <laughs> oh, jeez. Let's see. Maybe there's something here. Ah, oh, it's just gone. Oh, oh. Ooh, it's a choice. We're siding with Lita, right? We we gotta murder this filthy Moog worshipper. You disgusting molestator. <laughs> You're going to get destroyed. Besides, Needle Knight Lita, she had very well-based suspicions. Yes. Yes, let's murder this doting old man and take all his possessions. What's up, chum? Back. I will dispose of you. I find that I have a new apprehension. Your ambivalence. And exactly where it might lead you. So, oh, he's already fighting. You would call an old man such as I. You are thorough indeed, Lady Lena. I would expect nothing less. As you surmise, I do have my doubts, and will not simply lay down and die. Well, thanks for meeting you here. I am pleased. Now go and make yourself useful. So you've taken Lady Leather's side. I'm glad she stands with an ally. She tends to overestimate the burden she must carry alone. Buddy, you're still talking so calmly but you're getting absolutely destroyed oh it's an aoe it doesn't actually go anywhere this is a humiliation this is just an absolutely atrocious defeat what a bullying kind lord moog thank you for all that you have done sir ansbach Lita, you're a bit of a zealot, but I like you. I hope to ever someday take off your helmet and plant a wet, sloppy kiss on your beautiful lips that I'm sure that are there. Ooh, we got an outfit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And a longbow? My favorite. Uh, let's go see what Lita has to say about this. Ah, how wonderful slaughtering. Hey, hey, Lita, Lita. Does this remind you of someone? <laughs> ah, there you are. I appreciate the help in battle. Sir Ansbach must have considered it an honorable end, being felled by your hand. 
Very honorable. So I secured him with my rot. In the highest regard. When we speak of it, we may speak with pride that we were Sir Ansbach's final adversaries. This sounds like massive cope. Oh. It's a. S no, it's a amulet. Retaliatory cross tree. All right. Probably a counterattack. Enhance the attacks executed after rolling or backstepping. These. These right here. Whoa. Attacks that I do all the time. Like basically, just specifically this attack. Whoa, almost, almost hit her. Oopsie. You are an odd one. Yep, yep. I just enjoy carnage in all of its incarnations. And yet you alone appear completely unchanged. Still full of bloodthirst. Upon you. Hmm. No matter. If you found your way here, it was because kindly Mikula wished it so. But I am afraid this is our farewell. When next we meet, let it be under the eyes of Mikula the kind. Goodbye. Oh, jeez. Do you think... She's going to turn her suspicious on me, I wonder. This is when next. Okay, wonderful stuff. Let me uh, bring out my giant shield. We're going to be Sir Anshbach. <laughs> As we burn down this filth. Actually, no, I would like to get a good view of Butthole's delighted expression. As she burns down this filth. Let me put on a proper beautiful thing. I think the most dignified will be this pair of horns. Gorgeous. Let me go all the way up to the top again. I'm burned down this damn tree. Burn the way into what I assume is the final dungeon of Shadow of the Earth Tree. I'm trying to, you know, push towards the end. Yes, destroy it! Do we get to see Butthole and her incredibly incredible delight? At obliterating this filth. Now oh, you see her butthole. Her literal butt. Burn it down. And light the way. To the ending. Of the DLC. It's so insane. The scope of this DLC. You will be hard pressed to find. Full on releases. That are actually this big. All just a giant freaking expansion to an already enormous video game. What an amazing labor of skill and talent. Elden Ring is so packed with amazing talent from the visuals to the gameplay. But also, I'm always impressed with the language. I really love the writing in Elden Ring. Uh, the, the, the voice acting too is like amazing. It's like, everything is good, with the exception of all the little gripes that come up. But the general, the whole, it is such an amazing quality product. It is just so impressive. Uh, wonder of the world, you could say, in, of the digital world. What a weird place. Architecture, the, the architect of this place, uh, of the school of Escher. He loved those upside down stairways. Wonder if gravity is going to be inverted at some point. And I am just magically transported. How unnerving must it be to do a thing and then you're like, whoops, I guess I'm going somewhere else. I have no idea where it's at. Sure sucks to be me. Here I go, teleporting through the ether to a completely different place. Probably just to the foot of the dungeon. Yeah, you just, you just teleport here, huh? What you got? Sumber 9. I assume these doors there are no doors. Of course I don't have the right. I never have the freaking right. And then a summoning pool. Where are we? At the foot of this thing. But the thing is I want to go here. But I am unable to teleport. I see. Well, we are basically dressed in rags. Let me put on a more dignified helmet. So just the bear helmet. Actually, what else can we wear? What else can we wear? This is... There you go. <laughs> it's amazing. Oh, but that's heavy load. Uh, we just put on the wonderful festive hood. And in goes Butthole to do battle with her milady. 
probably the most beautiful the most beautiful um move set the milady is so gorgeous but the weapon itself is kind of ass <laughs> it's like uh barely any inner illin barely any poise damage be wary of left oh hello you're about to trounce my anus aren't you all right well let's do battle against this fellow slash lass all right we're not bad what oh you shoot bird crap <laughs> All right, you have done your thing. Now let me take it to the chin. I can just tank so many of your hits, you scum lord. Stop it. They will usually have a big follow up. Pathetic. Ow. I mean, I can just stab you several times. What the? Here, have some rot. Wee! <laughs> so no, uh, no helpful, no helpful. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> no, I mean to cast it. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh! Everything goes according to plan, though. Man, this fella, pretty brutal. But because I'm, you know, I'm dull. I'm being silly. I ain't even take you seriously. You're such a pathetic foe. Anyway, I am literally here wearing rags with weapons I barely ever use. And I still put you down into the ground. What an absolute loser. All right, I am so looking forward to the exploration of Enid Ilim. If that is the real name. Let's grab ourselves this side of grace. And I look forward immensely to this enormous dungeon. I assume I need to find out right now. I'm telling you, I bet these doors or whatever this leads. I betcha this goes straight to the main door. I need to check it out. Ooh, what you got? This is fire grease, okay. What do you have to say? How helpful. <laughs> uh, I'm sure that this leads to where I know it leads. Which is the main door. I mean, it's obvious, right? It's right there. And now it's open. But maybe there's an NPC waiting out here. There was one. I think it was Lita herself. But no, no longer anybody awaiting all right final dungeon here comes my butthole <laughs>